the coach or the refs kind of just figure out, like, oh, they're not really doing much, so we're going to put them on their feet. But everyone in freestyle is, like, in this position called the big bird. And so people on top are going to work turn. The most common one is, is a gut wrench when they have it around the waist. That's a gut wrench. Most people do. Wait, I'm sorry. Legless. Yep, so that was the one we did yesterday. Yeah. 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 Alright, so those are like two of the most common things to do on top. Um, so if he gets me in a gut position, I'm going to show you guys how to defend it. So it doesn't matter what kind of lock he does, because any lock, you can roll through. So um, the hardest lock to get out of is when people are going like this, called the butterfly lock. So we'll do that real quick. This one's a little different, and I'll show you how to do that in that one. But most people do like the regular lock. Do that. Okay. So when we have this little knot in your hand, this little ball, it's really important to like keep it in an area you can put a lot of pressure on. So I like having it kind of like right in my stomach, because that way I can take my toes, my fingertips, and just roll over his hands, and his hands just slide <laughs> in the mat, it hurts so bad. So that's how you do it. And then another thing is, like if people get a high gut on you, so on my chest, right here, so same exact thing, you're putting all your chest pressure right on that knot, and you're driving your fingertips and feet and sliding it down making it uncomfortable. If it doesn't break all the way, you're at least making it looser, making it easy for you, giving you more time, and then they put you back on your feet when they see nothing's happening. So we can do that one first. So everyone, get one person on top.